Hi everyone, so today um, in my daily vlog, well it's not really a daily vlog, but um, my quarantine adventures series, I guess you could say, um, I'm going to be talking about um, a new hobby I picked up, kind of, it's a work in progress. So, um, okay, so yesterday um, I was given a gift, for, like my senior gift or whatever, like one of them, and I mean, we've gotten a lot of good gifts, like, hold on, like, this one here, I'm just gonna pick it up, which is kind of awkward to hold, but I got this, okay, this is not the gift I'm talking about, but, um, this is also one of the senior gifts I got that I really love from the Marion Flower Shop, and that's not, like, a promotion or anything, I just really like their flowers, I've gotten, like, a bunch of stuff from there, and I just honestly love it all, um, and that's, like, genuinely me saying that. Obviously, I'm not promoting anyone. Uh, I got that from my friend's mom. She brought it over, and I just honestly really love the sunflowers and the roses. And the flowers from there are always such good quality. Um, okay, so getting back to what I was going to talk about, I actually was given a guitar yesterday. So I don't know if I've said this in any of my other videos. Probably not because I just started doing this stuff. But um, I really love to, like, play music, but... I used to play cornet, which is like basically kind of like a miniature trumpet with a slightly different sound to it years ago. And I used to play it like pretty well. And, um, well, I guess it wouldn't be like years ago, but like a few years ago. Um, and I used to play in a bunch of different bands. I used to play in a band down in Columbus, Ohio. Um, I played down in Cleveland, Akron. I had played so many places. And then last year I did dance and I danced in places like New Orleans, New York, um, I basically performed like everywhere, uh, not everywhere, but I performed a lot of places and I just got this guitar yesterday because I've really been wanting a guitar um, and I'm honestly just going to show it to you guys because I think it's really awesome. So, <laughs> Okay, so this is the guitar I got. Um, it's actually vintage because I don't really like normal stuff. Um, I mean, I do, but vintage is definitely more my style. So... This is a vintage 1969K guitar, and I don't know if that's really, like, necessarily, like, a great brand or anything, but I definitely love it because I think the 1960s and 1970s are when, like, most of the really awesome rock artists were around, and today I feel like we don't have enough of that. Okay, but altogether, I'm really excited because I've been wanting to learn how to play guitar for forever. Um, it is a little big, I know, but, um, that's okay. That's okay, because... Well, for one, I can't return it. For two, I honestly just love the vintage, and I feel like I'm not going to find that um, that many other places around here. And I just, I love the vintage, and also it's so pretty. I love this little design. Design. And also has, like, initials. Hold on, let me see it. I don't know if you can see them. Right there. And uh, they say, I think it says EJW, so... I don't know if that's like a guitar thing or if that's the musician that owned this before I got it. Um, Cause the guy that owned it before me was actually like a professional musician. I'm not really sure what he did per se, but yeah. Um, so I've been listening to that Marty's music channel. Um, I'm not really sure what the rules for YouTube are about mentioning other people's YouTubes, but I honestly have been using his lessons and they've been pretty helpful so far. So like this is an E minor. <laughs> I know guys, I'm feeling really impressed with myself because I know how to play in the minor. Um, sorry guys, my sister's looking at me like I'm crazy, which I am probably so. Um, and then this is an A suspended. And then this is an A major. I don't know. And then I think this is a D major. So right now I've been working on Bad Moon Rising, which is honestly not going so well. Um, I literally had this... My sister is so crazy, guys. Um, I literally had this since just yesterday, so I haven't been playing that long, obviously. Um, I... Uh, okay, hold on. Wait, and then I have to switch to this thing. Honestly, guys, I'm not very good, but like I said, a work in progress. I've only had it for a day. Um, and the last thing was a G major. I said this thing. I know what I'm talking about, kind of. Um, because obviously I want to learn the basics before I get into the songs. Because on piano, 
I know how to play a bunch of songs, but I don't know any of the basics. Like when someone says like, hit like an E chord or something weird like that, I'm just like, what's an E chord? Like, um, like I can read music and stuff, um, obviously from previous musical experiences, but, um, yeah, definitely don't know anything that like on the piano, so. Okay, also guys, I'm aware I look like a man right now. My hair is in a bun and it's like pretty tight, so yeah, but I do have hair, <laughs> I swear guys. Um, no, but I'm definitely excited to keep learning, so I'll probably make some more videos as I progress. They're probably not gonna be that good, obviously. Um, <laughs> but I'm not a music channel, so I don't care. Um, but yeah, it's definitely a really cool guitar. I just, I love it. And then, hold on, I'll show you guys the accent it has on it. So excuse my messy room no so this little flower i don't know i think it, somebody put that there um but it's definitely really cool i just love the fact that it's from the 60s um just because that's definitely the best time for music also excuse the noise in the background i have a bunch of little siblings i think i said that in a previous video but i don't know if that's just one i'm working on editing right now so it could be out when this comes out or what but um I have a lot of siblings, so they're very loud a lot of the time. Um, I've been working on this thing for um, this. It's like an Instagram account, but it's like an initiative kind of thing. It's called Written Connections. And basically, they do, um, like, you get to write, like, pin palettes. I'm not going to show you the front of that, but I actually worked on mine yesterday. So that's not one of the ones I got from Written Connection. That's just one I'm working on writing back to right now. Um and it's actually been really cool because I got connected to some girl that lives in Compton, California. And um, I feel like I probably want to have met her in another way. So I thought that was pretty cool. And I worked on my letter yesterday and I sent it out. So hopefully it makes it there all safe and I get one back soon. But basically it's like you, th you send out three letters, three pen pal letters in the course of um, the month of May. So I signed up for that just because I've been doing a lot of pen paling lately. Um just to kill some time during this coronavirus. And I thought it could be fun um, because right now I have a lot of like long-term pen pals. So like people I'm planning on writing like after just the month of May. And I've been kind of stressed out because I just have so much going on right now. So I thought maybe a pen pal that I just had to write a few times would probably be a good idea. So it was definitely really cool. And I'm excited to see what happens with that too. So I'll keep you guys updated on that. Okay, so this is my sister Josie. So she is just visiting really fast. So she can be in the video for a second. Hi, Josie. Ow. <laughs> also, guys, you can follow me at my Instagram, which is the underscore outcast underscore blog. Um, I also have a blog that I use that goes along with this. So, um, yeah, I haven't updated anything on there for a while now, but I have a blog that I use. So it's called the outcast blog. So feel free to check that out if you're interested, if anyone's actually watching. Um <laughs> Yeah, so, so yeah, guys, uh, thanks for watching. I appreciate it. And um, look, guys, I have hair now. No, I'm just joking. Um, but yeah, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video.